Hi everyone, Adam here, and this is a quick movie review of The Iron Claw. And this stars Zac Efron, Jeremy Ellen White, Harris Dickerson, Moira Tyranny, Holt McKelleny, and directed by Sean Durkin. And this is based on the true story of the Von Erich family, who, if you know about the Von Erich family, you know that you know that tragedy seemed to follow them wherever they go, that they even, that some people even said that the Von Erich family had a curse on them. And the story starts in the late 70s, where mainly the plot focuses on Kevin Von Erich, who's trying to make his way up into the wrestling world. And the plot focuses on the Von Erich family, all trying to make their way into the wrestling world while having to deal with their dominating father who even in the face of tragedy seems more concerned about wrestling than what's going on. Well wrestling is part of the story it really does more focus on the family and them having to deal with all the personal tragedy and their dominating father. I will say the wrestling scenes are done pretty well yeah and I will say pretty much all the main actors give great performances, uh, especially Zac Efron, who, I'll be, on, on a, I'll be honest, I've only really seen him do comedy movies, but here he really brings it. He gives such great performance. Here's the thing, I'm not that big on biography films, but I did like this one. I wouldn't say it's a fun film. It's quite serious and bleak, but it is a good film. And it is well directed, and the acting is top notch. Like I said before, Zach Ephraim, Zach Ephraim brings it. So, what am I going to score this? I'll give it a seven and a half. It's a fascinating story. Now, the question is, if you're not a wrestling fan, is it accessible? I think so. If you like a biography um, and some really good acting. I'd recommend it, even if you're not into wrestling, because it is a fascinating story. All right, as usual, just my opinion. Feel free to disagree, like, comment, subscribe. I'm Adam, and I'll see you again soon.